so let's take some examples based upon uh, parallel and perpendicular uh, lines concept that we did in the previous video so we have example here a line perpendicular to y equals to x plus x over 5 plus 3 passes through 1 3 what is the equation of the line so now first of all you need to write down the given equation so it is x over 5 plus 3 right so this can be written as if I write it like 1 over 5 x plus 3 it's the same thing right so what is the gradient of this line so gradient is equal to 1 over 5 right so this is the gradient now uh, let's say let the equation of perpendicular line is y equals to mx plus c so now you need m and c how will we find out m and how we are going to find out c that's our question now so let's say this is equation number two so from here gradient is one over five as i told you in the previous video when lines are perpendicular when lines are perpendicular then product of the slopes is negative 1 right so now here we have the gradient of this is 1 over 5 so we can find out uh, gradient of the another line so m2 is going to be 1 times this will become 5 over 1 which is negative 5 so m2 we got as negative 5 so now we can substitute this value in, from, in equation 2 so from equation number 2 we have y equals to mx now m is negative 5 x plus c now we need c we got m now we need c so we will find it from here now we are given that this line perpendicular line passes through 1 and uh, passes through 1 3 so this line passes through uh, 1 and 3 so x is uh, this is x and this is y uh, this is 3 equals to minus 5 times 1 plus c so 3 plus this 5 equals to c so c is equal to 8 right so then we can substitute this value over here so that is y equals to negative 5x plus 8 so this is the line of perpendicular now you see the slope is negative 5 here and the slope for the line given line was 1 over 5 so the product is negative 1 i hope you understood that so let's take another example line mn joins point 74 and 25 find the equation of line equation of ab the perpendicular bisector of mn so now we are given here we will go step by step line mn joins point so, so let's say we have point m here and another point n somewhere here coordinates of m are 7 4 and this is 2 and 5 so line mn joins point this and this find the equation of ab what is ab then the perpendicular bisector of mn so perpendicular bisector meaning that is in the middle somewhere this one so this is ab so we are looking for equation of this line so for that first of all we need to have equation of line mn for that we need to have the gradient so now you see we are not given gradient so gradient you know that we have done in the previous videos y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 that is change in uh, y and change in x so y is here 5 minus 4 over then 2 minus 7 so this is 1 over minus 5 meaning negative 1 over 5 this is the gradient of mn so we have gradient of m n is equal to negative 1 over 5 so now gradient of a b gradient of a b 
will be negative reciprocal of that so for that you have to find out m1 times m2 is equal to minus 1 so m1 we have negative 1 over 5 times m2 negative 1 so m2 is going to be negative 1 times 5 over 1 minus minus plus so m2 we got 5 right so m2 is 5 so equation of a b is going to be y equals to m x m is 5 x plus c so now we need to get the value of c now we are given that this is bisector right so bisector perpendic it's it's perpendicular also and bisector of m n also so that means this is the midpoint of this and this so how will you find out midpoint of m n midpoint of m n uh, we will take it like half of this 7 plus 2 9 so let's say this is point p so how do you find out coordinates of p p coordinate will be 7 plus 9 uh, sorry 7 plus 2 over 2 and then 4 plus 5 over 2 so 7 plus 2 is 9 9 over 2 and this is also 9 over 2 yeah so it pass this passes through now this line passes through 9 over 2 and 9 over 2 right so x is 9 over 2 y is 9 over 2 5 times 9 over 2 plus c so this is 9 over 2 and minus 9 times 5 45 over 2 equals to c so c is going to be 45 minus 9 34 34 over 2 that is 17 so we got c as 17 so equation of a b is going to be from here uh, y equals to 5x plus 17 right so this is how you can find out the equation of perpendicular line when you are given two points so i hope you understood that we will do more examples on uh, in the next lesson so thanks for watching see you in the next video